Ooh, look at that. They have a bike in the mall. This is the first time I'm seeing it. A lot of stores downstairs have shut down. I don't know how it happened, but it was actually a surprise, honestly. This really hot weather. Let's see how this ends up. Hmm. I'm glad. I also downloaded episode 50, which... Hello guys, it is 12.06 a.m. and looks like there is an event going on. Impressive. So, if you haven't seen yesterday's video, for a big part, I was talking about my gross gang montage and how I'm gonna put it all together after I end it on June 29th. There is a heckin' lot of police officers out there. Absolutely dramatic. That reminded me of only two days before we left the states the thing is it's just crazy to see a group of police officers at this time of day after midnight but what i gotta do right now is end the day and the beginning of the next day i gotta continue downloading more gross gang episodes and i was talking about episodes 30 and 31 which I am going to continue to find a solution to download the episodes. It is only a lot softer in this area when there's no dogs. Basically, it's like you get to chill in paradise. Oh no, even better, even better than paradise. Because sometimes there just turns out to be a fest. Okay, I thought this guy was going to come to me. But that would be friendly in one way if he did. No, it's hide and seek time. Even Smokey would play hide and seek with me if I peeked at him in the garden at this hour. Oh, good day now. It is 1.29 p.m. And after two days of break, we're off to another heat wave. And this time it really does feel sharp. And tomorrow we're getting rain. Today's a heat wave and tomorrow is rain. So last night was kind of rough. I continued to have some trouble downloading the episodes that I really wanted to download. Just to put some strong, I mean on the nice and funny side, strong captions into it. And check this out by the way, this is actually the first time that I'm even trying this. Have you ever tried this before? because this is chickpea flavored puffs and it actually tastes quite different than potato chips. Plus, it's 90 calories. And it's pretty decent kind of food for when you're on a diet. <laughs> time I'm seeing a bike along with a helmet that somebody actually took in a mall. Crazy. A lot of stores downstairs have shut down. Some stores have been replaced with new ones. I still haven't opened these guys right at this end. For the new store, they kind of chose what will be new for this area, which used to be Jack and Jones. All right, now things went kind of funny after I left the mall. I don't know how it happened, but it was actually a surprise, honestly. This really hot weather. Look at that. I got two Twister ice creams. And it came in a box. It came in a box of two ice creams. Let's see how this ends up. Hmm. It's still worth eating. 
at least it didn't melt too fast. What a summer treat. Oh well, like it came in a box of two ice creams and one guy had offered me them by big surprise. He was telling me they're gonna melt very soon. And like, what a feeling. Actually, what a feeling that is. It's like you're taking your bike and somebody offers you a box of donuts for free and get off and collect it. Wow. Honestly, it's that feeling that you just randomly get something offered. That was somewhat reasonable though. Now it isn't too hot anymore. If I would have got that box one minute ago, then hey, I can make a feast. I can make like a ice cream feast in a group of five. He told me eat them quickly, otherwise they will melt in a minute. And so I did. Now what's up with my world scan downloads? So I have now downloaded some episodes until episode 50. Finally I found one way to download it, and so I'm glad. I also have downloaded episode 50, which was the first episode of season two of Gross Gang. I'm rich. I'm rich. trying to do for now is in case if I go back to drumming practices on Tuesday because we still haven't got an announcement regarding when I go back to my drum practice but I am going to practice anyway so we had these sticks sitting on these plants for a while and so I am going to practice some drumming with these sticks now, I'm gonna try and see which method would really work for drum practice. So, when I do this, that means I kick. When I hit the tongue and when I hit the snare, all right, I'm gonna try this method. If it works, then perfect. If it doesn't, then I'll try another method. But with these sticks, it's kind of insane. But let me try this. <laughs> what a fun method to actually practice drumming. Okay, now I'm going to use my right foot for a kick because my left foot can't handle it for some moments. Let's try this. <laughs> okay, yeah. <laughs> oh well, when I get back to drum studio, we'll see that. How about if I try it this way? Oh, with this table it won't work. Alright. Okay, yeah. Stick is... So again, he bends so and try and make it a bit easier. <laughs> Man, it's actually slowly breaking down a little bit as I hit hard on the table. And the fact that the table's glass, so it's not easy to handle it with these sticks, actually. So, never mind with that. Here they go. Oh, this stick already got broken. So, it looks like one of those two, or even both of them, could have broke if I would have hit them too hard on that glass table.
that was my test with the drum practice in the house and how difficult it was with those sticks actually it was not easy handling the way that you play following the beat with this kind of a thin stick at least it's a lot better than doing it with the hand but sometimes it just comes to a point where it falls out of hand i thought it would be worth doing it today anyway so that i don't forget my scheduling last december i had done two vlogs where at some point i would do drum practice at home on which i had used my hands on both occasions instead of the stick but today i used the stick instead since it's been more than three months since i last went to the studio and practiced the drums normally i'm that kind of guy that doesn't lose memories on anything so today i wanted to practice with the stick and get as right as i can in case if i go back on tuesday center tomorrow so already getting prepared you heard me right so tomorrow I am going to return it was a nice two-day break in which I did take more than 10,000 steps, so the five digit numbers. But tomorrow, it's time to get back. It's, I, I'm not gonna do it every day. I'm not gonna push myself too far. It's just that I'm gonna do it on a certain day of the week. Like a weekly schedule for when I would go to NatFit and do my athletics instead of go for five days in a row and then take time off and then go for six days in a row. Honestly, I feel like it worked out very well for when I went to the fitness center for nine days in a row. It actually gave an impressive result of how I worked out. So it's that situation now I'm going to put myself back into weekly fitness schedule. And now that's the end of today. It is after sunset, and goodness, it has been another hot day. And hopefully this will bring a good amount of rain tomorrow, by chance, as I head out and do my sports thing, and many more. In the end of yesterday's vlog, I did say I wanted to make today a productive day and a productive vlog. Well feel like I've done the right thing. So that is it for the vlog today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. And I will see you in the vlog tomorrow.